Welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and this is a 1967 Chevelle. This baby's got a 396 under the hood, and sitting on top of that is a fuel injected unit. She is race red and beautiful. Now, I'm calling it race red because I had a car last year that was almost this exact same color, and that's what they called it race red. This, or you call it rest me red. <laughs> This thing is amazing. It's got air conditioning, it's got four wheel disc brakes, it's got oversized wheels on it, it's got a beautiful paint job on it. The bottom of it is all finished off looking beautiful. She is just sweet as can be. You can see that chrome's looking good, the aluminum grill's also looking sweet. I'm in love with this car. Of course, it could be the race red that I'm in love with. I've had a lot of red vehicles in my life, so it's probably one of my favorite colors on a hot rod. She is just absolutely gorgeous, man. This trim is all looking good. Beautiful car here. It's got a great looking stance also. As you look down the side of it, all the body lines are looking good. The doors lining up nice. All the trim is also nice. Just beautifully polished. You see how the door lines up real nice down here? And then the stance on it's just killer. Of course, the back end's raised up maybe an inch, an inch and a half more than the front. Love the wheels. Really looking sweet. You gotta kinda do a double take. They look like stock wheels, but those are 17s. You see how nice that door operates and how nice that door jam looks. They've replaced the rubber. Door panel looks like it's new. They kept the skinny steering wheel. I love the skinny steering wheels. Those seats, all the upholstery looks new. The backs of the seats are looking good. We got seat belts in the front and in the back. Package trays nice and clean. The uh, headliner's in beautiful shape. I mean, everything about this car is just as gorgeous as can be. It's got a Dakota digital dash in it, which is super cool. It looks like it's got an aftermarket radio. Of course, I know everybody sees that gear shifter in the middle. That's hooked up to a Tremec transmission. So you got five gears to go through so you can get this baby out on the highway and hum. Back in the day with a low gear in the rear end and the four speed, you could not get one past about 65 miles an hour without tacking out over 3000 RPM. And look at the back end of this car. Now, a lot of people are gonna be looking at the back end of this car because you're gonna be flying by them. See, I got three keys here. I'm going with the round key. And it doesn't work. <laughs> square key, nope. Another square key. Boom, there we go. Look at the trunk, look at the finish in there. Now, whenever you're buying one of these muscle cars, make sure you pull up the mat, look at the trunk floor. Look at that, looks like it's brand new in there. Beautiful finish. That splatter finish, that's what would have come from the factory just like that. She is gorgeous. We got an old school um, spare tire in there, which is super cool. Old poly steel radial Goodyear. You can see the gutter system around the trunk openings all painted up looking good. Also the uh, Seals all replaced. We got great looking um, paint on the underside there. They've got all the uh, jack instructions and everything. Shutting down nice. The lenses on those tail lights are looking good. The emblems look like they're brand new. That passenger door is fitting real nice, just like that driver's door fit. Man, she looks good. And then of course, black interior. I don't think I told you about my favorite black interior, my favorite color red. So this is one of my favorite cars, guys. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we do not do any consignment whatsoever. That means we own this car. So you know we did our homework before we checked it out. And a lot of you are thinking, what does that mean to me? Most classic car dealers sell on consignment. They sell just about anything that'll roll through the door and they don't know much about the cars. Finding a Vanguard quality car isn't easy. Our team of 15 buyers review thousands of vehicles each month. Our inspectors travel all over the country to handpick each of our cars, which saves you time, money, and frustration. Think of us as your expert hands, eyes, and ears to make sure that you end up with the highest quality cars. We have almost 50 team members here at Vanguard, and every one of us is a gearhead. 
Growing up around the Motor City, all of our families worked in the auto industry. I grew up working in the garage with my dad, and we worked on countless classics over the years. Around here, cars are a way of life. Take a 67 for a ride, baby. You want to talk about sounding amazing, looking amazing? This thing is badass, guys. Super cool car right here. Driving nice, feeling nice. Trans feels good. Steering's feeling great. Handling the corner great. Tell you what, I'm in love with this 67. I really love the color too, man. This color is popping, looking beautiful. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we can ship this car anywhere in the world. You just give Tom a call at 248-974-9513. Tom will tell you just how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. It doesn't matter where you live. He'll take care of all the paperwork for you. He'll do everything you need. If you want any close-up pictures of anything, no problem whatsoever. He can get you some more pictures of the car. You want some personalized videos? No problem with that either. You can always hop on our website and collect all that stuff also. Go right to YouTube. Talking about YouTube, we have uh, 1.5 million subscriptions. I can't say that word very good as you can tell. And I want to thank every one of you for subscribing to our channel. Now down here on the dash, doesn't this look beautiful? It's all stock location, but it's all aftermarket stuff. All those gauges are looking just absolutely gorgeous. We got an aftermarket radio in it. We got aftermarket heating and cooling controls. She is a beauty. Got a bunch of traffic coming here. Brakes feel real good too. Now we're right outside the Motor City. So if you'd like to come visit us, we're very close to the airport if you need to hop on an airplane. Or if you want to send an inspector, got no problem working with your inspector. You just call Tom and let him know you're coming. That way we can have everything ready for you. We've got uh, about 40,000 square foot building over there. Um, we call it Junction Street because it's on Junction Street. That's where we keep all our cars. We've got our, uh, two, our four post lifts over there. So we may have to dig your favorite car out, so just give us a call, let us know you're coming. That way we can have your favorite car all ready and we'll get it up on the lift. We're headed back to the shop right now where we're gonna put this baby up in the air so you can check out the bottom side of it. Man, is she beautiful on the bottom side. There's our main location at Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. We're located right here in the Motor City at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. This building is where our team of 15 world-class mechanics inspect and improve every one of our cars. All of our work is done in-house. Our mechanics only service the vehicles we sell. We start with a thorough inspection and test drive, then our team gets to work. We take the time to learn each car and fix the things that I would fix if it was mine. If that means the engine needs to come out, then it comes out. When you purchase a classic car from an auction or another dealer, in most cases it hasn't been inspected or serviced. You may be in for some unpleasant surprises. At Vanguard, we save you from the headaches that cost you time and money by handling this process for you. Right down the road is our 40,000 square foot indoor showroom. This building is climate controlled and houses over a hundred amazing vehicles. We're constantly bringing in new inventory so you never know what might show up tomorrow. We are underneath the 67 now and it is pretty. You can see the tank's been replaced. You can see the frames all painted up looking nice. 
All the exhaust is all, looks like it's fairly new. We got like a bed liner material on the uh, floorboards of this thing looking beautiful. We got great looking paint on the rear end housing. This is a 12 volt. I just rolled it over, counted right around a 373 gear, and it is a uh, posi. You can see that it's been upgraded to a coilover setup, holding up the back end. We do have disc brakes out back, uh, drilled and slotted rotors. You can see the wheels are brand new, nice and clean. These adjustable lower and upper control arms here, on the, they're in the stock locations. Uh, drive shaft is an aftermarket drive shaft. It looks like it's new. These look like Flowmaster mufflers. Um, they don't have any writing on them, so they may be a knockoff Flowmaster. Uh, looks like new parking brake cables, new um, brake line here going front to back. Uh, they've ran new fuel lines here. It looks like the uh, filters right here inside the frame. We have a uh, Tremec 5-speed trans. It's got the stock clutch linkage on it. It's got an aftermarket al aluminum, say that three times fast, aluminum bell housing. We got lower control arms are tubular with coilovers holding it up. We got uh, tubular upper control arms. We got disc brakes up front too. That's all uh, aftermarket stuff. Everything looking clean there. The backing plates are new. We got aftermarket uh, steering parts up front here. We do have a sway bar up front. The uh, front frame horns are nice and straight. We got a big aluminum fan, um, a big aluminum radiator with electric fans. I'm getting ahead of myself today. Uh, aluminum uh, crank pulley here. Uh, the power steering pump is all polished up, looking good. The uh, chrome on the front bumper looks like it's new. We got some great looking wheels and tires. Now these are aftermarket to look like the original wheels, which are super cool. Uh, I believe they're 17s. Let me see if I can find the size. Yep, 215 50 17s. Good looking, the center cap looks like it's uh, original too, or original style, I should say. Uh, that wheel well's all nice and clean. The wheel lip molding looks like it's brand new. As you look down the side of the car, you can see the rockers all nicely painted. Door gaps looking good. And they've blacked out the um, pinch weld here. A lot of guys like to do that so you don't have to look at it when you're looking at the side of the car. Frame's got real nice looking paint on it. Out back here, let's see, 235. I can't see it. 235.50, 17s back here too. Well, let's lower this baby down. Beautiful under here. All the chrome looking good. Firewall shaved. Uh, it's got a sniper EFI setup on it. So it looks like a carburetor, but it's not. It's a, a fuel injection setup. Um, it's got an aftermarket intake on it. We do have power brakes. We have a Willwood uh, master cylinder here. You can see that upper control arm. You can see the steering shaft, everything looking new there. Inner wheelhouse is nicely painted. Uh, we've got a whole new drive system up front here. Uh, we've got the uh, water pump is uh, aluminum looking good. We got the AC pumps all polished up. The alternator, if I haven't already said that, uh, I know I had my hand on it. It's polished also. Valve covers obviously chrome. Uh, jet coated headers. Uh, the firewalls, just the paint on it is looking beautiful. Uh, it looks like an aftermarket distributor, a stock appearing coil on there. Everything under here is nice and bright. Now, this is a Be Cool radiator. Um, we got the top on the battery here. It makes it look like the old fashioned battery, which is super cool. Bottom side of the hoods, chassis black, looking good. Guys, this is one beautiful 67 Chevelle. Give us a call, 248-974-9513, and let Vanguard Motor Shields park this dream in your drive.